what don't they do right now when it comes to kids. To be a part of this today was a huge honor for me. It's a real, real powerful message today. It's really an investment in these kids. It's not charity. I think people see the commitment of our club initially to making it a better community. But I'll never stop working to build that city of opportunity for young people that you all serve every day because this is really about their future. This is about creating the kind of city we want them to inherit from us. And that's why it's so important to me to have organizations like our club as a partner in so much of the work that we do at City Hall. We couldn't do it without you, and I mean each one of you. We could not do it without you all. The Our Club is such an important partner for us here in the city of St. Petersburg, and so for me to be here, it's important to show support uh, for, for the organization, uh, to let the community know uh, how important Our Club is to the city of St. Pete. He didn't speak till he was almost four. He was nervous. He didn't have any social skills with other children. Have you seen the well-to-do up on Lenox Avenue on that famous thoroughfare with their noses in the air? It was perfect. I just couldn't believe I did this. It was like the feeling of good. The whole journey with Jake has been um, amazing, emotional, wonderful. Um, he's, he's a great gift and a blessing and um, I, I was just a proud bubby today. I can't, I can't believe I did that in front of the mayor and I did it in front of a lot of, of the art club people. I just can't believe that I just did that in front of all of them and made them so proud. Our club is doing an amazing job and, uh, and, and everybody that they have working there, from my experience, has been really caring and, and really wonderful with, with all the children, even those that are exceptional. There are hundreds of stories out there and mine is just one of them. As a mother, a teacher, and now a tutor, I can say to you that our club has a positive influence on my community and in every child that they care for every day. Our clients like our club have inspired our culture and it's a culture of watching our clients like the our club do incredible life-changing things every day. I mentioned happy workers. I just uh, found out that their school readiness scores came up very high uh, uh, with a lot of growth, so we're on the right track. You need to see happy workers because all the kids of that community need is a chance. They're not looking for anything special. They're looking for a safe classroom, great teachers. They have the great teachers, but our and our club took up that cause. As somebody who has been a part of our club as a teacher, as a tutor, as a mom, they have provided such an opportunity for kids all around the country. But here in the area, in the Tampa Bay area, I get to see it firsthand in my classroom, the difference between the kids that go to our club and the kids that have to go home to them by themselves and don't have those people helping and supporting them. And it's an opportunity to give back. Our club is a major partner of ours, so it's a wonderful experience for us to be able to kind of see the highlights of all the progress they've made over the year and the impact they're having. Having individual testimonials, especially of the children, that's why we go to work every day. Oh, it means, it means a lot. I mean, ASI, Progressive, we've been kind of partnered with our club for, for years. We have an our club in our, in our corporate headquarters, and it's been a great uh, perk for the employees. There's a history to both. I um, mean, Louise Graham, you know, since 1949, our club since 76, but they both were also like grassroots community efforts to get started. Um, and so that's part of it, too. I think people see the commitment of our club initially 
to making it a better community. It's, it's amazing, you know, and Art, Art was talking to me, uh, and I had no idea about this, that they provide child care services for uh, the Rays, you know, it's just like, what, what don't they do right now when it comes to kids? But, you know, that's the beauty of this organization is it is, it, is, it never settles. It never says status quo is good enough. It's always, what else can we do? How else can we make a difference in the community, but in particular for the kids in our community? We continue to add programs that develop the whole person. Uh, we've been funded a number of years through our HIPPIE program, which allows for our staff to go into homes and work with the parents to teach the parents how to teach their students to read. Every year they seem to take things up a notch, all for the betterment of children and the community. And one of the cool things about our club is that they do it with the community. They pull the community in and have them as part of the conversation, part of the plan, because that's who they're serving. And one of their greatest strengths is their ability to make those connections. They do a good job at branding. You know, everyone's familiar with the Art Club logo, and I think that's really important because the more facilities you build, the more you can populate them, and the more people understand that that service is available. And while there are a few other services like Art Club, I think Art Club is clearly at the top of the class. So it's really gratifying to see it expand. Thank you and see you next year.